What's going on football fans? Marshall Ferguson here. This year at the CFL Combine, a new piece of technology took over. You're gonna to wanna to know more about it because it's gonna teach us a lot about what we love in our game. I'm joined by Dan from Wilson and Jamie from Cattle. Guys, thank you for being here. It is the Wilson X Pro Connect to football. Now I'll begin with you, Dan. What is this thing? What, what am I looking at here? Because this looks like a normal football to me, but there's something special about this. Well, that's right. It is a normal football, but inside we have one of Wilson's proprietary chips embedded inside. And what that does is whenever a quarterback throws the ball, it picks up all kinds of different metrics about what just happened. It picks up play timing, it picks up how tight the ball was thrown, how fast it's spinning, how fast it's thrown, distance it traveled, all kinds of stuff. Now for you, Jamie, the, the wearable side of things is really the game changer in this because when you pair it with Wilson's technology and the chip inside the football, you get a different understanding of what quarterback play really is to pair with all of these metrics. Yeah, exactly. And the catapult device is made up from a positioning sensor that can use either local positioning or GPS to calculate where a guy is and then calculate velocity and things like that. It also has three 100 times a second sampling rate uh, accelerometers to give us really accurate identification. And there's a lot of side benefits that we're starting to get a real feel for and part of it is putting a quantifiable number to what has for a long time been identified by simply the eye. And it's never wanting to replace what we see as football expertise and knowledge, but it is to fortify that and really validate what the best players are doing and really use that as the benchmark. Now, I want to know, because this year at the CFL Combine, there were two great quarterbacks, and Chris Merchant from the Western Mustangs and Michael O'Connor from the UBC Thunderbirds. When I see those guys throw, it zips out of their hand. And, and people always talk about the eye test, right? We're all familiar with the eye test versus the metrics. When I see those guys throw, they're both special. But you can tell the difference between special being 1A and special 1B. That's kind of the goal of this, is not to be able to separate and understand the truth behind the quarterback play. Right, absolutely. But that's some of the things that we try to uh, quantify here is that we're trying to measure something objectively. We're trying to be able to say that year after year, quarterback to quarterback, throw after throw, this is the way everything compares. We're not trying to tell you who to draft. We're not trying to tell you who is going to be the best starter in the future, but this is another metric to be able to measure against.